Well, good morning here to you from Kentucky Gamer. We have a Massey Massey Ferguson update today. But before we get to that, I do want to talk about we had two maps to drop today. Now, do not ask me to pronounce these because, hey, I'm a southern hillbilly. I can't pronounce these. But we're going to say cleansing him. 2k21 now this map looks like it has everything to offer I will leave links in the description it looks like it's a small map uh, square fields and such a village area type situation It's going to have three courtyards, a uh, yard two with pigs, farm three with sheep, chickens, cow sheds, 26 fields, seven meadows, seven cells, outlets. It's going to run forest, forestry work, and a BGA. Mm hmm. That sounds interesting. We will definitely, uh, well, no, I won't say definitely, but we'll check into it and I'll see if I want to do a review on it. The next one is a Porta Barana Farm. Hmm. Baran, Barina, Barina, I don't know how you say it. But we will check into that. It is a map based in the region between Barana SP uh, Okay, I'm sitting here reading the description. I'll be honest with you. I know you guys are from other countries, guys, girls, or whatever. But now, you need to put it in the description a little bit where we can understand it. But the map has three prepared locations. One main, two medium locations. Uh, the other starting with a player with a field. this one here I'm a little confused about I'm sitting here looking at the pictures and it looks like a big highway with a lot of round fields I uh, no, I don't like round fields so much as long as they're decent might be okay but I've seen some where you have to go up on the side of a mountain yeah I'll check into it I'll let you know I will leave the link in tap. Now, the next thing we are going to check out. <laughs> the Massey Ferguson 4200 series. Well, now that's interesting. I would call it the Little Massey situation. Here, let's get this thing out of the way here. And we will come up on these little tractors. Wow, oh, look at this. Now, I am assuming the tire situations are set up for uh, rice fields. I don't know. I do not know. But I would think so. I mean, they all look good and everything. They are great looking little tractors. I've fooled with them a little bit. Messed around with them. But they are the Massey 4200 series. And small tractors, by the way. Now, I'm not going to go through all the descriptions of these. I'm going to just bring it right here. Because with every one of these, we have a 4275, 4x4, 78,000. We have a 4x2, 4275, 72,000. We have 4290, 4x4, 4 92,000. We have a 4290, 4x2. Okay, every one of these, actually, 
they run you 23 slots each. That's a pretty good deal, I have to admit, considering what all you can do with them. However, if you do this, the required mod is a GM front loader pack. You'll find it in front loaders, which is um, looks to be a pretty good, decent pack. Let's just go over to that real quickly. I did notice that the pack is, to my opinion, kind of competing with CSX. Now, you have the front loader, first off, you can put on. Okay, it will fit your AGM style, or you can put it regular style, whichever you want and I will describe that uh, in just a minute. Every one of these mods, one slot each. Good deal, yeah, I agree. The big bag transport rack, uh, sorry, I have to throw that in. I was the first one created that. I'd done it with simple mods that we had in game and everything, one of the first few mods that came out. Okay. Never mind that for now. Let's take a look at what we have here. Look at these massive wheels. I mean, they are trippy. <laughs> no, I didn't grow up through the 60s. I was an 80s kid. But look at this stuff. I mean, that's just plum wicked. I'm thinking uh, maybe rice fields, something like that. Yeah, kind of cool. They are very cool. But we will run down here. I will show you a couple of things here. Now, this is a regular Valtra 104. And you can set the front loader for the AGM pack to hook up on regular front loaders, as you can see. Works really well. I don't see a problem with it. When you do that, you can come up and pick up all the rest. Uh oh, I think. Yep, there it was. Little touchy, but it was also forks. You know me as a gamer, I don't like forks. But, I am liking this mod, though, completely. I believe uh, CXS needs a little bit of competition, and I think it's great that they've done this. So, let's carry on here. Uh, we're going to pick up a... Wow. We have so much to look at in so little time, I just don't know what to do here. So, let's jump in this one. Massey Ferguson MF4283 Let's go back to little tractors for a little bit here These little tractors are just awesome to what I see in power size everything you can change rim configurations colors and such okay now standard configuration put your weights on you run lizard tires you can switch out different things and it'll run your wheel setups all different types good deal until you get to these, uh, what do you call them, Mad Max kind of vehicles. Kind of cool. But like I said, I think it's for swam uh, swampy lands, uh, rice fields, such. Different things like that. Used rice tires. I want to know what this used deal is. Why can we get used tires? It's kind of interesting. What are they creating? Protection grid, of course. 
standard. There's the front grills, old school, new design. Fenders uh, puts a little black line. Front fenders, also mudguard, rear fender changes, complete fenders, everything there. Engine set up, uh, let's see, uh, we can go all the way up to 105 horsepower, they work good. Exhaust, you can change to uh, the original one, two, chrome, back to original, can't complain. Uh, the old design, which is here, as you can see, just the original Massey Ferguson setup detail new design black label and in correct lighting you can see actually a good mf right there and of course front loader yes and no you can do the agm style or you can run the front loader stole design whichever you want to do out of all these I bought and set up, guess what? I have no idea which one I put on. But I do think the Massey Ferguson has set up a new deal here. I like the way they're going. I like the setup. They sound absolutely awesome run really well uh, 19 miles per hour yeah okay we can understand that they are a little tractor good for small field such and yeah the, I think they will work awesome uh, any that anybody that watches my let's play they will see that small fields are working pretty good now this in here has front loader attachment just a small little two-wheel drive tractor good backup horn now this one has probably I'm going to guess here Uh, no, it does not. I did not set it up with this design. All right. What a shame. I kind of wanted to check him out. I may have changed it here in just a second. But this one does have the AGM design. Front loader 600. It's connected up. Wood blocks disappear where they sit on. Very handy, convenient. That's why I said that, well, maybe CSX could be getting a little bit of competition here. Universal bucket. It's very well. Now, all the um, AGM designs, all these, which is very cool, one slot each. Cannot complain about that. The prices are very low for each of them. I think all of them will work very, very well. It is worth a test and try every single one of them. I have not tested them because I'm running way behind on time today. Everybody else jumped ahead of me and I had some things going on. I said, well, you know what? I got a few people who do want to see in here. So I'm going to do my best to put it out here. Big bag handler. Oh. Now, to me, that looks like it's upside down. see what all it will pick up here can we do bells 
Oh, there it flipped over. There we go. Good deal. And that seems to work. Uh, fair. Little tractor, of course, though. So. We will keep that in mind. But if you wanted to get pick up just one thing I'd say it will work better let's see what it does here move it out just a little bit pick it up better yeah it's a little flippity flip I have my own design of this setup and I might just go ahead and preview that very very shortly the way I see it I can actually use my design and pick up logs and everything this one seems to be a little bit squirrely oh yeah totally Alrighty then. Well, I love the tractors. They're all great. The rest of the machinery here, I will have to check into, kind of look it over, test it. Everybody, uh, let me know what we come up with and what we find, what we hear, and we will shall see. So, next we have the Unreal Tree Devourer. It cost 11 slots to put it in. Let's see what it looks like here. You will find hit under forestry equipment. Their hit is 125,000. Um, original slot count is 11 slots. Now you can change colors, whatever you want. You play with it, do as you please. Design color is your sticker color. Right up there. Now I don't really know what all it will do, but they said it'll clear 100 trees in seconds. And I did notice it will follow a wagon, trailer, whichever you want to call them. Folds. It's called a wood crusher. Let's go see what happens here. I probably really should be using a larger tractor for this. We shall see. Let's go find out. Let's go play with it. I started to do this whole video, just go buy it, look at it, and play with it. Okay, it is on. Can't lower. Hmm. 
let's go get a different trailer and see what happens here because so far I'm not seeing much these are your standard base game trailers we'll see what happens here Oh, hold it. Trailer's got something in it. Let's just dump it here. There we go. It's empty. Let's see. Can we see? Is there anything in it? Looks empty. Turn on. Hmm. Well, kind of looks to me like the matter of clearing trees in a matter of seconds hundreds of trees as he says well, I thought it, we had an improvement but stumps Trying to go forwards, trying to push, trying to move. Uh -huh. I'm still trying, still pushing hard here. Trying to figure out the situation, secret. Well, friends, farmers, everyone, I don't like to leave bad comments, but either I can't figure out how to work it, it will take a whole tree and make it disappear. I have uh, other equipment that's easier to operate and more satisfied. <coughs> Anybody wants to comment, tell me I'm doing it wrong, whichever. Go for it. We do have a mower. Let's check out the mower. Hopefully this starts working out a little better this is a massey ferguson mower you'll find it mowers it uses 10 slots cool looking little deal i have to admit let's unfold it see what it looks like kind of nice pretty looking let's see what we got here go over to mowers and check it out and mowers there it is DM 306 FP K 18,000. And like I said, it is 10 slots, 3.2 meters. It is what it is. No changing, no fixing, no nothing. 
but still could be a very cool mower. We're gonna hope. We're gonna lower it down. See what we have here. Hmm. It's interesting. It's already putting it in rows. Which we all can use. Trying to see if there's any way to change it. No, there isn't. Which is fine. Nobody really wants to change it after it's a windrow. Unless you're running seasons and have to run a redry, really that's different. I do kind of like it. Good little 3.2 meter mower. Happy with it. Sounds good. Runs good. Does as it should. Like I said, I keep my mod reviews short. I try to run them the best I can as quickly as I can. I want you to know the information of what's out there, what works, and... We are welcome to new mods every day. We don't get them every day, but when we come real close. Curious. Had to check. Well, we're just going to leave this here for you people. I'm sorry, but uh, not incredibly happy with it. I will look on the details real quickly and see what it says. The 4200 series of the Massey Ferguson small tractors is really good uh, the AGM front loader equipment is pretty good big bags pack uh, kind of a little frigidy so Eric Isaac and agro mods sorry guys work on that a little bit Unreal Tree Devourer. This machine is capable of devouring hundreds of trees and trucks in a few seconds. So its price is quite high. Hmm. Well, to my opinion, you already paid too much. Sorry to be that way, but that's the way I see it. The mower works great. LS Agrar and Ol. Good job, y'all. Keep it up, bring me some more good work. That's kind of the way I see things. I don't want to be that way, but... I will post another video of the big bag handler that I created out of old in-game mods. And it works a whole lot better than this. Happy farming, y'all. Keep searching, keep looking, and may your crops grow good and become wealthy and rich. Good day. Happy day. If you do like it, I did give my honest opinion. If you don't, well, that's the way life goes. If you do like it, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.